Good morning, Hoosiers, and welcome to Times News 24-7, brought to you today by Fourth Hawk Consulting Business Efficiency Specialists. Your local news in an efficient three minutes or less starts right now. I'm Stu Clampett with today's top headlines. Preparing for Noblesville Preservation Alliance's 29th annual tour of historic homes has been a year-long job for some people. The tour is 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. on Saturday. Seven homes plus the old sheriff's residence and jail will be open for visitors. Advanced tickets are $10 and they are $12 the day of the tour. Also, everybody loves a good mystery and a good comedy. And if you combine them, you have The Butler Did It. That's according to Noblesville's Jeff Bick, who is directing the show, which opens tonight at the Belfry Theater in Noblesville. Tickets are still available. The show, which kicks off the theater's 2015-2016 season, runs weekends through October 4th. Also in today's Times, Jeff Eaton, owner of Barley Island Brewing Company in downtown Noblesville, will open a new production brewery and tasting room in Noblesville as well. Deer Creek Brewery is scheduled to open in early October adjacent to Noble Corner at 17661 Cumberland Road. You can read more about that in today's Times. That's your local news for today. Let's look at that weekend weather. The forecast for today calls for a slight chance of showers and thunderstorms. It will be partly sunny today with a high near 83. Tonight brings a 50-50 chance of showers and thunderstorms. It will be mostly cloudy with a low dropping down to 67. On Saturday, we see a chance of showers and thunderstorms once again. That's mostly before 2 p.m. Then a slight chance of showers, mostly cloudy skies, and a high near 74. Saturday night looks partly cloudy, dropping all the way down to 49 degrees. Sunday should be mostly sunny with a high near only 70 and an overnight low all the way down to 46. That's your local news and weather. Sports is up next. Hello sports fans. Here's everything you need to know today in Hamilton County sports. Tonight, four Hamilton County schools will play at home. Westfield, the only undefeated football team in the county, and Hamilton Southeastern will get the spotlight in their game at Lucas Oil Stadium in downtown Indianapolis. For all of Friday Night Football fans, the Times has what you need to know on page A5 today. Also, Westfield's Grand Park will play host to College Game Day Softball Tournament featuring 14 teams from Indiana on Ohio on Sunday. Of the 14 teams attending, 9 come from the Division I rank. Details and ticket information are in today's sports section. That's your local sports for Friday. For more information on these and other stories, click on our e-edition or pick up a print copy of the Times. For Times News 24 Four seven. I'm Stu Clampett.